Assalamu alaikum. Today I brought you a complete process of acoustic duct liner insulation which is done inside the duct. Now this is the tool list which is required to be job done like you have stuck up pins insulation that is this insulation is with adhesive before there are some insulation coming like uh, fiberglass acoustic lagging now there is another type now this is little advanced now self adhesive duct liner also coming so now we are starting with the measurement initially we do the measurement of whatever piece we will do the duct acoustic lagging duct acoustic liner for the HVAC system so in this process what we will do we will take the measurement of the duct length and the width as shown in the video first we will take the measurement and this as per the measurement we will uh, cut the roll of uh, duct liner as you can see both sides we took the measurement and then we will clean the duct inside completely before starting the process so you can see now we will open a new roll of uh, duct acoustic liner as you can see this bottom is the self adhesive tape so now we will take the measurement guys please subscribe comment share this information to other people you know in your contact list who were learning or who want to whoever want to learn HVAC system or anything inshallah I will bring you more more videos complete installation of MEP services it's already in process so as you can see how we are uh, taking the measurement and cutting the insulation and this this portion we are just removing because when the material delivers because it is laid you know bottom level so the insulation thickness get reduced so what we will do we will remove this one and uh, this portion we will remove it and we will use the balance one if you can see before this fiberglass insulation will come that is you know it has more gap now this thickness only 15 mm we are using for this project because it is no gap now we are using this 15 mm acoustic lagging insulation for this project because as per the concerned specification what is specified so based on the concern specification specified we will use so normally if it is uh, previous projects there is 25 mm thickness of uh, fiberglass insulation now in this kind of insulation self adhesive type will take very less time how you will see in the further video why because it has self adhesive if you compare with the previous uh, fiberglass uh, insulation those insulation without self adhesive those insulation required separate glue we need to clean the duct we need to apply the glue then we need to put this uh, apply this acoustic lining then it will become little you have to wait little time for the dryness then again and after completion of whole inside uh, for four area fixing we will again do the canvas clothing for the corners do not build off the 
broadcasting insulation due to the air flow of the machine HU or FCO whatever so one side we already cut the insulation the actual uh, length we are cutting it as per the duct size because it is marked two side then we will put this GI corner for to make a straight and a straight cutting as you can see safety is very mandatory at site you have to be proper safety see this cutting guys if you want any other video you want to see like any kind of video you want to see in regarding this MEP works or anything just comment me inshallah I will try my best to make video for that please subscribe share with other people because this kind of video to make and bring to you it's take lots of uh, thing you know I have recently uploaded one video like for the HU inspection as a couple of days ago if anything you have you want to know more in that you know then documents or you need more information required for any video which I am uploading or previous videos free frankly asked Shall I will provide everything proper cutting is very important see this it's required little skills see here we cut the pieces and we kept here This piece was uh, HU duct piece. That size is very big. If it is FCUs, are very small pieces. As you know, that FCUs are uh, just one ton to three ton only. So don't have much flow. So ducts are very small. In this, we have uh, big size of duct. So so proper cutting is very important. If you can see. See these two pieces we already cut. As you know that acoustic lagging to be done three meter or till the first branch. So this that piece is big piece because of the H H flow is more. So we need proper cutting. And because of that also this is big size. If you have anything you want to know, just comment and share. We really appreciate it to provide you the details. So any kind of detail regarding the site works, project engineer, site engineer, foreman, supervisor, site engineer, sergeant, responsibility, scratch from basic to I can provide you. Inshallah, I will bring out the testing commissioning videos also. How we will do the testing commissioning for the MEP works. So, any, any doubts you have or anything not related to this video or other video, other works also, you can you can make comments or you can request for that. I am ready. I am ready to provide the proof. 
need to help. I am here to help and I will provide the information because at my time and I was a beginner. I was looking for those kind, this kind of information to know. We were running to get this information. So I don't want you people to suffer this what I suffered so I am putting my full effort to make this video arrange the arrangement of all work I will inshallah coming videos will come by putting also plumbing also including the CAC now we already cut all the pieces now so now we will start the process of Inside the duct, the casket lining or a casket liner inside the duct. As you can see, and one more thing I want to tell you in this we already, before starting this video, we already marked the, the cupping marking inside to avoid this video to be big. So we have already marking where we we need to fix the two cup pins. These are the two cup pins are available in two inch or one inch. But as for the thickness of your insulation, if your insulation is more 50 mm thick, then you need bigger two cup pins. Now we have just 15 mm thickness of insulation. So just we have 25 mm length of two cup pins. You can see as we fix already marked over there black marking you can see we fixing exactly there as per it might now if you see the stick up pin distance also mentioned like uh, 250 300 the stick up pin or the arrangement uh, inside the duct we need to measure it and based on that we need to fix it for example you have 1000 length and uh, you are following 30 mm distance stick up pin to stick up pin then only three will come. So based on those calculations, we need to make marking. So we are already marked inside the duct. So based on that marking, we are fixing the stick up pin. The same process is applied for all over the duct. So we fix the all the stick up pins over there. Start uh, fixing the insulation, a caustic lining, a caustic liner. My every time I am going to build a caustic lining, a caustic lining is usually used in uh, plumbing uh, pipes because uh, in like hotel fridges, the pipes are open and hospital projects, mostly a caustic lining will be done wherever it's required as per the client requirement or sound level to avoid the water flow so anyway I will provide that also information that also will come that, all, that also in my in my video posting so you can see we just remove the just we peeled off half of the avoid this if you can see the front uh, flange area we avoid it because of the if you can see we avoid already in the flange area where the duct connection duct to duct connection it will be done that we avoid it otherwise it will looks like you know so that area we in order to avoid uh, you know any problem because of the flow it can be peeled off so due to the safety purpose stick up pins required compulsory after stick up pin 
fixing the inserted, inserted the duct costing insulation into it and then we will apply the whole duct because of the blackness of that it is not visible clearly due to the poor light that area but you will see in further video the completeness of uh, insulation how it looks like I covered all four sides take a stock acoustic liner in this video so you watch full video you will come to know how we avoided corner how we match the corners of the duct if you want to see any other part of work you want to know you can comment me so that I can provide you as you can see this area already fixed the other area we are applying you can see I have zoomed in this area where we avoided the insulation as you can see we are showing by hand and we are just uh, we make sure we are just making sure this uh, insulation fits properly or no in this area where the other couplings are fixed. The whole the whole the costly land the process will be done in the same way and uh, we need to apply we must fill in the duct both sides that is make sure otherwise this self adhesive insulation or any glue type insulation before you applying any kind of glue or self adhesive type insulation you must clean because it has that dust so because due to the dust you know it will not get fixed properly and it can be come out in future so these ducts will remain for 25 years or 20 years 30 years we don't know so should be proper perfect work so nobody should finger out uh, to us now we are applying washer to the stuck up in as you can see from the top we are inserting the washer after the washer we will cut the balance pin you can see this we are applying washer to place the washer until the insulation touches the liner touches then cut the balance pin by the cutter as you can see in this video You have to make sure it's already pro uh, properly fixed all over the duct. Then we'll start cutting this. See this, and where you can see the flange area we left out of the flange we started. because of that it can be come up the insulation and there is no chances of field off immediately so we, re we avoid that area both sides all four sides now we will cut this and same thing will apply for all the duct please subscribe share Press the bell icon button. Comment for the more videos. Give me the big, big thumbs up. Your support is very important to us, to our team. So. Yes.
here as many people we can was the whole video complete process of duct liner you will come to know everything inshallah by this video you will get all information of duct liner the difference only in this type of uh, fixing and uh, fiberglass glass insulation depends on the glue you will after cleaning you will apply glue here we are applying directly the coupling so that also same we will clean we will first we will uh, fix the coupling in that fiber glass type of insulation we will first fix the the coupling then then we will apply the glue after that we will same process of fixing the insulation in, in old I mean like so fiberglass insulation type of work we will apply also in the corners and was closed and post stuff because it is fiberglass so there are more chances of coming to avoid that, we will, uh, we will fix or we will apply poster and canvas cloth all corner or front side where the flange, flange area, corner. This side we will fix the poster and canvas cloth. Now you can see the marking is clear here. So enjoy the whole video. Because we are following the same process all over the duct. Please share, subscribe, and give me a big thumbs up and please press the bell icon. I will come up with the new video. The coming videos are more interested and uh, more knowledgeable very soon I will I'm going to upload duct installation fire fighting process from the from the material plumbing from the material the basic preparation all installation work will come up all video one by one video will come up of course you have any question regarding this civil issue you can you may ask Please enjoy.